Jesus lived a life of honor. Psalms chapter 33 and verse 5. He loves righteousness and justice. The earth is full of the goodness of the Lord. The Lord our God is righteous. He is just. He is almighty. He is a great God. There are several other descriptions that we read about God and we are in awe of him. Uh, when we think about the fact that he sent his only beloved son to die for us, you know, we receive this revelation that this mighty God honored us enough to die a brutal, painful death to redeem us from sin and the consequences of sin. What an honor God has demonstrated towards us. The life of Jesus again is a testimony of a walk of honor in all things he looked to honor the father he put the father first he remained in the bosom of the father as in the presence of the father uh, and he wanted the father to be glorified in all things and today uh, as believers and children of god god is calling us to honor him he is the first person that you and i must honor uh, in in every aspect of our lives honor begins with a humble spirit and that too uh, was demonstrated in the life of Jesus because Jesus became obedient even unto the cross Philippians chapter 2 uh, records this for us that Christ Jesus humbled himself uh, that he was uh, willing to go up on a cross as well uh, and fulfill the will of the father and he was honoring the father uh, in doing this act of obedience and in the same way if we ought to walk in honor towards god and towards man we need to walk with humility uh, and 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 that will enable us to fully glorify god and to live as his disciples uh, and because we are people in relationship with other people yes we ought to honor god and this honor shows up in honoring people and what a better place to honor people than our family uh what uh, a better place to honor people uh, than in in our workplaces and especially you know if we are uh, in a position of leadership even there we can demonstrate servant leadership where we honor those uh, who we are we are leading in Christ uh, and in all these ways we can demonstrate honor for the kingdom of god and this culture of honor can begin with one person and yet it can be contagious so why not you and i begin where we are and we will see this culture of honor take over let's pray together heavenly father we thank you for this example of honor that you have set for us god it's such a privilege that you have honored uh, each one of us so oh god and and god that you became a a, a man leaving behind your glory so that we can walk in your abundant blessings father god we pray that we too will learn to honor you back father and lord that we will honor the people that you've put in our lives thank you lord for empowering us to do this in jesus name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally for more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk please visit apcwo.org